Hey guys, my name is Crystal. I'm doing a reading for um, Air Signs, Aquarius, Pisces, and Gemini. And I have a few Oracle decks. I'm going to pull a couple from each of these and see where we go. <clears throat> okay, so Air Signs, you have the Three of Swords, the Page of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, and the Nine of Cups. I feel like there's some type of new inspirations now. I feel like your mind is at a different place now after a broken heart, after some disappointments. Um, could have been cheating, could have been something in the way of getting what you wanted. It could also be just, you know, maybe a job didn't work out for you or some type of family situations left you feeling like heartbroken, disappointed. Could be love, cheating, and stuff like that. Page of Wands just tells me now you have new inspirations, new passions, and stuff like that. You have your mind on something new now. One of your focuses could be on your career, could be on your stability, on your growth, on your wealth, you know what I mean, focusing on you and on your well-being and stuff like that, um, getting the things that you want, like um, the Nine of Cups is a wish granted card, so like whatever you're working hard towards, whatever this passion is, I think it's going to actually come to fruition if this is what it's talking about. If not, the Page of Wands is a mission messenger card and I feel like um, maybe you're thinking about sending somebody a message because now you know after this heartbreak I don't know maybe you left the situation or something if not I feel like anyway your mind is off that now and now the page of wands is something where you're about to um, start heading so somebody no I'm gonna change this a little bit I don't know if you guys could see but um, you have mystic healer okay you guys are air signs very intuitive and stuff like that very in touch with your um, intuition healing energy flows through you okay so you have mr killer so you may be um somebody who helps other people get to <clears throat> get to where they need to be you have reaching your destination okay this says your light is shining bright so don't worry if you um okay so let's say if this is your job like you're focusing on your career maybe your career has something to do with healing other people okay and you're reaching your destination your light is shining brightly so other people are noticing you right and you may be helping other people find their light as well which means like healing finding their way to go finally like you know showing them the light in the dark you have far away places okay get ready for new horizons all right, so things are about to start changing, and um, I don't know if you're moving, but if not, whatever you're doing is going to take you a long ways, okay? I feel like this is going to be a long-term stability type thing. It could be love, it could be whatever. Um, anything could be long-term stability or a long-term situation. Then, yeah, stepping into power, you are strong beyond measure. I think you're starting to notice all your strength. I kept on saying the last couple of readings I've been doing for the, at least Aquarius, where it's like get your power back. I feel like you're finally stepping into your power. You're finally starting to gain that, like, you know, um, believe in yourself. And, you know what I mean? Not letting the sadness and disappointments hold you back anymore. That's now in the past. You know what I mean? I'm sure it might still bother you or whatever. But, you know what I mean? I feel like you're moving on. Yeah, building blocks. You're building these, um, you're building for a new future. You got orphaned, all right? So this may be, like, maybe you guys had a hard time growing up. Orphan is usually, like, somebody who feels alone. Somebody who thinks they have nobody unloved, unwanted, didn't really have a good family situation, or it could just mean that maybe you're just feeling orphan, like, you know what I mean, like, not cared about at this moment, um, or it could just say that this is how you grew up, and whatever, right, but you have building blocks, I feel like you're kind of growing from this, and you're starting to, you know, by you healing other people is also helping you heal, right, you got to be fair, and then you have imagine, definitely, um, manifesting, um, a new thing, Okay, manifesting fairness, ma manifesting balance, all right? This is also saying maybe you need, you might, oh my God, <laughs> maybe you might need to take some time and meditate, okay? Then you got listening, all right? Sometimes it's better to sit back and listen rather than sit there and keep on talking. I don't know, um, I'm going to read that for you guys because there's more to that. You got cycles, all right? So you are going through an ending of a cycle and this is also saying like learn past cycles and try not to repeat them again. So you're going through an ending of a cycle and, and through a beginning one and through a new one. I'm going to only take message wishing. All right. So you got two cards about wishing. All right. So you're, it's like, you know, make your wish and leave it to the universe and allow them to, to bring it to you. You know what I mean? Allow them to do the rest. And you have message. So I do feel like there's a message coming in for you um, regarding something. It could be love. Like I said, with the page of um, wants, there is cards about messaging here so messages and then i'm going to read 23 23 listening 
In my house tonight, there will be a beautiful girl with skin of car color of dark honey who has the gift of poetry. She is able to weave tales with great detail and expression, yet without being obvious or straightforward. Reading between the lines and finding true meaning are what are required right now. Listen and learn. What others don't say is what is important at this moment. So I don't know if you feel like somebody is lying to you. If you're still kind of stuck on this situation, I don't know if you're still with this person. Maybe you feel like they're lying. Maybe you just like, you know what I mean, are finally having your mind pushed on something. Now you're focused on your career, focused on getting yourself straight. You know what I mean? So you may have not, you may not have left them yet because you have risk. Alright, there's a saying, take the leap of faith, okay? Take that leap of faith that you're thinking about. Whatever you're thinking about, it's like, go ahead and do that. And you have understanding, okay? So there's always a reason for everything, alright? We just, once we, we don't always have to know the reason for everything. We just have to know that if it's good for us or bad for us, and then we need to do what's needed, okay? It is one thing, this is understanding. It is one thing to read something or hear something, but it is another thing to truly understand something. You're being asked to keep an open mind and heart and allow yourself to absorb information as you receive it. Be open to be open to the wisdom that can only come with time, patience, and perspective. Try to get outside yourself and imagine what it is like to walk in someone else's shoes. To understand is to have power. I don't know. Maybe you are um, having a hard time trying to understand somebody. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Maybe you do. But, um... Yeah, that's what I got for you guys. I hope you guys like my content. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm going to do something for the future. I don't even know what's coming for you guys for the future. Besides, you're going to get your wishes granted. The Chariot. Forward movement towards success. Whatever you're doing is definitely going to be success. All right? The Nine of Wands. Somebody's going to be hurt in the end of all this. Okay? It is an ending. All right? Four of Cups, feeling like you missed an opportunity. This can also mean that you're trying to ignore somebody's um, offers, okay? Somebody's trying to offer you their time, their love, you know, whatever it is. You're like, nope, because it wasn't bringing you balance, okay? So somebody's going to get left hurt in this situation because somebody's about to move on from broken heart. Move on from disappointments. Move on from not being happy, you know what I mean? And that's what you're going towards is your stability and your happiness, all right? So that's what I got for you guys. Now I'm done. <laughs> Alright, have a good day guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.